to place the solar panel glass side down onto a piece of foam on a table and you're going to affix the main structural component onto the back of the solar panel and you want the narrow side of the L to be against the solar panel and that allows the brackets that fit onto the unistrut enough room to rotate. So you'll take a three quarter inch stainless steel bolt and washer, place that into a hole and tighten it up with a nut and your nut driver and repeat that until you've mounted the brackets securely on the back of it. The next step is to slide the mounting brackets into the unistrut. So I'll show you how they work. The mounting brackets have a little plastic tab and when you push the plastic tabs it opens up the bracket and that'll allow you to slide them into the unistrut like that. Repeat this for all four brackets. Once you have the all four brackets slid into the unistruts, you'll have two brackets on each unistrut, then you, then you need to measure those and, and make sure that the distance between the brackets on the solar panel is the right distance apart and then tighten the bracket in place. The next step for the second unistrut is to attach the uprights. So these are the pieces that will hold the solar panel upright. To attach the unistruts to the back of the solar panel now that we have the brackets mounted in place. Now we attach the bracket to the mounting plate that we had attached previously to the back of the solar panel and then we tighten that with a nut. This is the piece that will be sitting lowest to the ground and we tighten that up You'll need some extra hands for this one, and then you attach the second unistrut that has the uprights attached to it to the back structural panel on the back of the solar panel. Once you've affixed the unistruts firmly to the back of the solar panel, you can now lift the solar panel, put it on the ground, and picking it up by the panel itself, set it down. And then you may need to adjust the angle of the unistruts to have them firmly on the ground. Tighten all of the nuts firmly so that the solar panel doesn't move in place. And then with tent stakes, stake down the corners of the unistruts. This is what the final installation of the solar panel looks like. It's mounted on two unistruts that are staked to the ground with tent stakes and have two upright supports and two supports on the ground.